from the Toastmasters Dis. Greetings. Today's word of the day is bittersweet. I'm taking a one day break from the six dimensions of leadership in the Toastmasters Leadership Program. I want to comment on the loss or the promotion of the San Francisco 49ers defensive coach, Robert Sala. I'm bittersweet because he had a four year run with the 49ers that was absolutely amazing. He took over a team that was in rough shape, helped them get to the Super Bowl following the 2019 season. This year, the 2020 season, they were decimated with injuries, but they always played above their expectations. They always overachieved. And it, he was a fantastic leader and a fantastic coach. Coach Sella needs to be congratulated because this is the way it's supposed to happen. When you take on a role and you're wildly successful, you need to get promoted. You need to go to the next stage and put your skills out there on the next level. And he's gonna do that in New York. Now there's some challenges. New, the New York Jets have had a tough time for many years, but Coach Sala is a leader that if anybody could turn that team around, he's the one. Why is he a good leader? Well, in my opinion, football is the ultimate team game. There is not one person on the field who could be successful if they're not getting the support of everybody else, if the other players aren't doing their job. And when you look at a defense, you're getting a mixture of people from all walks of life. Take, for example, Richard Sherman and Nick Bosa. They're both incredible players. They're both players that have a good chance of making it to the NFL or the Pro Football Hall of Fame, but they came from different backgrounds. They've got different feelings, different perspectives, and different experiences. But yet, they find common ground. And the common ground is they want to be successful as a team. They have the other players back. So Coach Sala, I hate to see you go because I, I loved the excellence you brought to the 49ers and I loved the passion you showed on the sidelines. I wish you much success in New York, but I'm bittersweet. So my friends, please like and share, comment and subscribe so this conversation can go far and wide and we'll find that shining needle of common ground in that haystack of fear.